Welcome, welcome, welcome to another Pokemon TCG Dead Building Day. We're looking at Blastoise and Pink Club Tag Team GX. Yes, I I don't mind these two. These two's pretty awesome. Pretty awesome on their own. Pretty awesome as a tag team. I really dig it. Um, 270 HP is kind of normal for a tag team. What can you do? It's all right. Um, water type is good because then you get to beat a lot of fire decks, especially with Wilder running around. That is a very cool thing to have. Um, you also get um, little adjustments for things like, say, for example, oh, I don't know, Quagsire to dish out water energy back up. Um, you get Frost Moth now to get um, water energy attached quicker. Um, you get things like Switch Wrath to switch over and heal at the same time. It's good. It's not bad. A few little neat tricks for water types. Not too bad. Three retreat cost is annoying because we don't get things like buff padding and uh, things like air bloom will make us retreat by one. So that's rather energy I'd rather like to have. Um, weakness to grass is okay. You get things like Rillaboom running around. So be careful of those decks, I guess. Um, yeah, you don't really see many grass types around, but not to say that they're not played at all. Um, it has two attacks. Um, first off, two water and one colorless. Splash maker for 150. You may attach up to three water energy cards from your hand to your Pokemon any way that you like. But if you do, heal 50 damage from those Pokemon for each card you attach them in this way. So you can heal up to 150 onto one Pokemon or you can heal 50 across the board. Uh, or you can heal 50 across the board. Did I say that? Heal 50 across the board. Yes, I did. Um, and that works great. It includes Blastoise and Piplup as well. So you don't have to make it anyone else. You can make it to just the Blastoise and Piplup if you want to. And for the same cost, two water, one colorless, Bubble Launch GX for 100 damage. And your, uh, your opponent's X Pokemon is now paralyzed. But if this Pokemon has at least three water energy attached to it, has to be water, it does 250 damage on top of paralysis. Pretty good. I like that. Won't exactly knock out things like Mewtwo and Mew, but it'll make up a pretty good damage. Make them force out a switch, maybe. Um, yeah, probably put them in a pinch. If not, to hit KO for us. Yay. Um, of course, Blastoise and Pitlop is not alone. So first off, we have the Dene GX, just for a little bit of extra draw. Slap it on the bench, discard your hand, draw six. Everyone loves the Dene. Dene is great. We have Keldeo GX, um, just to counter, well, Keldeo GX. Um, or Alone in Ninetales if they use it, but you probably might not see that. It's more Keldeo. Um, prevent all attacks from Pokemon GX or EX. And for 110, two water, one colorless. Again, seeing a big, big pattern here. Um, this attack isn't affected by any effects on your opponent's active Pokemon. So a Keldeo can hit Keldeo if you guys are wondering. And for the same cost, Resolute Blade, 50 damage for each of your opponent's bench Pokemon. So 250 max damage. It's all right. Nice hefty bit of damage. Nice... Nice chunky bit of damage. We only kept one copy of Keldeo in just because we might not see it, especially since uh, Pokemon Vs are running around. You might see more Pokemon Vs than GXs, but just in case, it wouldn't hurt. We also have two copies of Frostmoth. Um, I'm so happy about Frostmoth. Frostmoth is great. I've been waiting for water types to get that love, and they finally have it. Um, Ice Dance. As often as you like during your turn, you may attach a water energy card from your hand to one of your bench Pokemon. Doesn't cannot be the active, has to be the bench. Um, for those of you wondering, you can mix match this with Quagsire to slap um, energy from the bench to the front because Quagsire will drag it from the bench to the active. But Frostmoth cannot bring it from the hand to the active because that would be too overpowered. We also have two copies of Blastoise GX, um, just in case, kind of to help with Frostmoth as well. Um, it takes 30 less damage from attacks, so technically 270 HP instead of 240. But if you have Power Plant, it will be 240. Um, and two water energy, it does 60 damage for every water energy you shuffle from your Pokemon into your deck. So it doesn't have to be Blastoise again, can be everyone across the board. So, for example, if you've got Blastoise and Piplop set up, if you've got Keldeo set up, but you want a fair bit of damage, Blastoise will literally bring out all the energy back to the deck and you can just do an incredible amount of damage. We are also rocking with two costume catchers, one energy recycler, um, two evolution incense, two great balls, two pocket gears, one quick ball for our basics, one rare candy for Blastoise, three switch rafts. Now, I've not seen many people use switch raft, but for water decks, I feel like this is a must. Um, switch your active water Pokemon with one of your bench Pokemon. Has to be active water, cannot be active anything else. So, it, say if we did this for the Dene, it would not work. Um, if you do heal 30 damage from the Pokemon, you move to your bench. So, anyone besides the Dene will get swapped into the bench and will also heal 30. Fantastic for water decks. I'm surprised no one really uses this as much as they should. Um, two Tackles, two Chaotic Swells, one Coach Trainer, four Cynthia's, two Cynthia Caitlin's, one copy of Marnie, two Misty and Lorelli's um, to search up water energy. And if you discard five cards from your hand, you can use the, your water GX attack again. 
pretty nifty, pretty useful. Um, one Professor Arms Lecture just for our basics, so Squirtle and Snom. Um, three big charms to increase HP by 30 on everybody, so Blast and Piplot would be 300, Kodo would be 200, and Blastoise would be 270, but also with his ability he would also make it up to 300 technically. And 13 Water Energy, so with that being said, let's jump into it. So, lightning, Psychic, Dragon, and Colorless. Why do I feel like it's Ultra Necrozma? I just have that weird feeling that it's Ultra Necrozma with a few little details. Um, brilliant! Blasters and Piplop to start with. I'm fine with that. Shame we didn't get Snom. Snom would have been very useful. Even Squirtle would have been very useful to be honest. It's a shame. I don't like running with one Pokemon on the bench. It makes me so anxious. Dene. Okay. Well that's good for us anyway. That's, uh, that's nifty for us. At least we know what the lightning type is now. So, Cynthia, um, water energy attachment, Cynthia next turn, we should be good. I'm guessing that is going to be for, yep, Inkay. Okay, so Naganado as well, I'm guessing for a, for a nice one shot. Um, Ultra Crossbow? No, Mewtwo and Mew. Okay, bigger damage. Oh, bigger HP, I mean. Okay, I need to work quick. Oh gosh, he's very aggressive with this draw yeah so I need to be quick because um, otherwise I'm gonna be in a bit of a bit of a pinch um, ultra echo I'm expecting ultra echo but it might not be because there is dragon type I love opening Jigglypuff that's gonna be a problem they're gonna be a huge huge problem for me oh god wow he's really bringing out the Pokemon huh he is really bringing them out is this toolbox is this a, is this a form of Mewtwo toolbox I think it is Right, Blastoise Pip, attached to energy. Cynthia, don't curse me, please. Cynthia curse, don't happen. Uh, Blastoise, big charm would be nice. Great ball for... Yeah, I'll take Squirtle. I'll take Squirtle then, I guess. Can evolve into Blastoise next turn, which is fine. Um, let's see, he'll do one attachment. Oh, that'll be 120. Best he can do is 120, but then he'll need to swap out to Denny as well, but he has switches. It's not too bad. How are you guys today? Anyway, I'm doing pretty, doing pretty good. Um, made a few trades on the online market, but my gosh, the online market for trades is horrible. It is actually really bad. There's a lot of trades that's open, and you're like, wow, seriously. And speaking of seriously, okay, I guess we got Marnie. Um, but yeah, there are a lot of um, there's a lot of trades that that's really like uncalled for. Like I know there's what's it? Someone's asking for like there, there's like people who ask for like. A, a, like a pack or like a little minor card for something really minor like I don't know for example oh what's a good card right now um what's a good card that I have right now say more Pico V Max let's say more Pico V Max they'll ask for like I don't know like something like a quick like two quick balls or something like that for a more Pico V Max and it's like that's really that's really uncalled for like that is really really bad I'm a bit shocked about that as well that is really bad like I'm so I'm so shocked of the of the trade market. You get a few people who actually make decent trades. Cause for me the way I look at it is that if it's a decent trade enough, like if I don't think if I don't think I use the card enough, then that's fine. If I don't if I have if I already have four of that card, that's fine. Um I don't really let's get rid of I'm gonna say Evolution Incense, I guess. Cynthia I'll come back. Um, draw, 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 water energy, frost moth, but no snom. Um, right, now he's going to hit me very, very hard. Night Watch is the card I'm going to be worried about the most, because if he gets rid of Cynthia, I'm going to be very, very upset. Splash me, um, But yeah, so the way, I, the way I trade online is that if I have four of the card already that is non-tradable, I don't mind. I can easily trade it. It's not going to bother me. It's not going to do anything to me. I already have the four. You're only allowed four of most cards besides energy. So I won't really care. Um, for something like, I don't know, if it's worth it, like say for example, a really good V or a GX for say a pack and I don't use it, then sure. Because I know I, I traded over Mega Sableye and Tyranitar because most dark decks that I make that have it in it, I don't include more than one because the amount of chunkiness that it is 
takes too much to revolve around it. It's only there for like that last kind of techie type of card, if you get what I mean. Like I know a lot of people um, kind of used um, kind of used Mega Sable and Tyranitar as like a tech for uh, like Umbreon and Darkrai. Like you'd uh, get red and blue, slap it onto Weavile, um, get the extra energy on, and by that point use Nanu, swap it over, and you're you're ready to go, pretty much. Um, so that's that's the only that's the only thing I have with it. Switch Raft, Blastoise and Pip. Um, I'm gonna attach the Blastoise and Pip now. Good thing about this is that he cannot knock me out. The only one he can knock out right now is Squirtle. Yeah, that's the only one he can really take out right now, which is very very good. Sorry, so knock that out. Um, choose my three cards. I'm gonna say one of Blastoise and Pip. Um, another one of Blasters Pip because he's got no he's got no draw and the last one on that one. So he can either pick at Squirtle, pick up Blasters and Pip that's on the bench already. Um, if he gets Squirtle, he's got the knockout. If he gets Blasters and Pip, it's it won't be a knockout, but it'll be a good chip. Um, he could do Dragonite's attack for 270, but I have 30 HP left over because he can't get rid of the tool card right now. That's fine. I'm fine with that. I am completely fine with that. Discuss three energy. Yeah, I'm completely okay with that. That's why we got Keldeo as well. Um, slap that over. Actually, let's get Evolution Incense. Let's get Wordtoto out here. Let's get Wordtoto. There we go. Shame we don't have got Snom. It's a shame we haven't got Snom yet. I'm hoping we do get Snom. Right, let's GX this. Let's let's do GX. Let's paralyze him because then we can get a good game rolling. Um, still no Snom. Great ball. Please get me Snom. Snom, Snom, Snom. No, still no Snom. Right. Well, Frostmoth is fine. <laughs> Um, that's a shame, man. We haven't got no Snom yet. Right, Pokegear. What have we got? Misty and the Ready. That is very, very good. That's good. Um, right. I'm going to keep it like that. Um, Bubble Dodger. Right, there we go. 250, Paralysis. If you get a Switch or another Draw Support, that is going to be very lucky. Um, energy Spinner fine still paralysis the best you can do is heal 20 but by that point i will have you i will have you uh i mean if anything i can retreat if i don't get swift if i don't get switch raft i can retreat um back to blastoise and pip um energy recycle misty in the rally rare candy i don't really need rare candy i can cynthia again I just do Misty and the Rally. To be honest, I'm in a good spot. I might as well do Misty and the Rally. <laughs> While I'm here, wait, so this does 60 for every energy attached to your opponent's active. Okay. Alright, so draw back, 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 back. I'm gonna say. Hmm, do I say energy recycle now? No, no. We'll, we'll leave it. We'll leave it. Um, draw two, and there we go. We're gonna keep it like that for now, just to heal them, just to heal them up a bit. Um, we can get Snom and Frostmoth in a second. So that's another two. Oh, that's three. Forgot because it's tag team. Quick ball as well. There we go. Quick ball. We can get Snom. Fantastic. We can get the little. We can get our boy. We can get our boy Snom. Um, then indeed will not knock me out. Um, but to be fair, I won't be able to knock her out either. Which is pretty upsetting, um, but you know what? What can you do? Have I used the custom catcher? I think I have. No, I haven't. Oh, okay, no, I haven't. Um, right, that's pretty good. Um, I won't be able to knock them out. Um, Latios is going to be a problem, which means I need Blastoise and I need him quickly. Or Keldeo would work actually. Um, right, I'm going to energy recycle. Um, get me seen the rally again. Set up Keldeo because I can stop Latios and Dustmore and Trevenant. Okay. Okay. We're in a bit of a situation now. This card is going to be a very, very big situation. I'm going to have a bit of trouble with this card, but you know what? We can, we can do this. That's fine. We can do this. It's alright. It's not too bad. 
So we've got three energy in the discard. We've not wasted any energy, which is great. 190. We might lose Blastoise and Pip next turn. Oh, there we go. Blastoise, fantastic. Um, let's say energy. Actually, you know what? Quick ball first. Rare candy. Bring back Snom. There's Snom. There's the boy. Little Snom. Oh, I love Snom. Amazingly, he's not one of my like one of my favorites, but he he's grown on me. He has grown on me. Um, energy recycler, bring three energy back. Uh, Misty and Lorelli, beautiful. Ah, oh, I just realized what I could have done. I just realized what I could have done. But you know what? It's fine. It's fine. We'll drag it out. We will drag this match out. It's okay. Um, then, you know what? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. We will not do that. We will not do that at all. Right, so... Two energy on. It's going to be a risk, but I'm going to... Actually... No. Just... Keep it on Keldeo. What are we doing? Just slap it right on Keldeo. Don't try and be fancy. Don't try and be smart. Just keep it on Keldeo. To be fair, all we got to do is knock out Ndidi and we've won. Like, that's it. But I realised what I could have done. I could have literally just discarded all five cards in my hand, get the energy, and then just do... Uh, bubble launcher again to get the 250. Ah, oh, so stupid. But you know what? It's fine. Just don't don't worry about it. We got it. We got it regardless. Hmm. Yeah, that's it. We got it regardless. Bring out Latios. We can do Caldeo and just slap it that way. Won't even have any energy quick enough anyway. Um, Dust Lord Trevenant will get the KO. As long as it's not Symphony and Kate, actually, as long as it's not Symphony and Kate then, and Tag Call, we'll be alright. Right, there's Marnie. That's not good, actually. I could have needed, I could have, I could have used that. As long as, yeah, as long as Tag Call comes up, which it does not, unfortunately. Um, right, so we've got no draw, but we've got Keldeo set up, which is a good thing. It's a very, very good thing. Um, there's a custom catcher. I hope we get another custom catcher to just knock out Indeedy. Hmm. Ah! I see what you did there. But why didn't you just... I don't know. I, I, why didn't you just hit me anyway? You could have literally just hit me and it would have put me in a spot faster, but... You know what? It's it's fine. It's all right. I guess it's not the end of the world. I suppose. Um, okay. It's not like it's not really the end of the world, is it? And there we go. That's. That's kind of it. Unless you have Great Catcher. If you do, then I'm going to be so annoyed because then that's bit, that's the other Blasters and Piplop. I'm going to be so annoyed if you manage to pull that off. Has he got another one? He might. Do, I'm not going to put it past him that he might have another one. I actually wouldn't put it past him that he's got another one. Oh, God. If he does have another one. Does he use Custom Catcher? No. I have a feeling he's got... He's got it. I have a feeling he's got it. Oh no, I have the feeling in the back of my head that he's got it. Wait, how much damage did indeed do? Well, I mean, it's a stalemate now. 60, so... 6, 12, 18... He can knock me out with... With Indeedy. But now I've just won. You've just gave me the win. You can heal up all the damage you can. I've... You just gave me the win. You would have had better luck discarding my hand. I mean, that's it. It's done. I guess that's it. You would have had so much better luck getting rid of my hand. Oh, well. Well, GG regardless, but it's a good, good effort, I guess. And then Blasters and Pip just just end it, I guess. There we go. Yeah, dude. Um, well played, I guess. <laughs>
I'm not even mad. Right, next game. Right, so pure fire. Well, we've got a major advantage this time. Right, no worries. We can live with this. We can live if we don't go first. We can take it, I guess. Okay, mulligan again. Um, I mean, switch wrath works amazingly. Just that nice little bit of... That nice tiny little bit of healing. So say if you do Switch Raft and then do Blastus and Pipla, that's 180 damage you can heal on one Pokemon. That is that is very, very useful. Right, I'm gonna do Quick Ball, get rid of Poke Gear, bring out Snom. I'm gonna say Snom. Oh wow, I like that promo. That is a really nice that's a really nice promo. Yeah. Right, so I'm gonna do that. Quick ball, Poke Gear for Snom. I only have one Snom and one Frostmoth, which means two of them, both of them are in here. Which is unfortunate, but you know what? What can you do? Snom, I'm going to do Marnie. You better, we better shut that down straight away. Right, Dedene, Big Charm, Rare Candy and Switch Raft. Um, well, we've done all we could. I could Dedene now, but then that's no... Oof. No. No, 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 no. We're gonna, we're gonna leave it. We're gonna leave it the way it is. Another Charizard breaks in. Energy. That confuses us, doesn't it? How much energy is it? Is it one extra? Has this one extra energy attached to it? Your opponent's has Pokemon's are confused and blind. Okay. No. It's not too bad. That's literally just to burn and confuse us. Honestly, kind of a waste of a GX in my opinion. You could have waited, but... Uh... Right. Oh, well, there you go then. Um, Next game, I guess. Right. Wow, advantage even though they have the typing. Okay, this is going to be very interesting. Right, let's see what happens when we actually face someone who has advantage against us. Right, Blastoise and Piplop again. Oh my gosh, just, we're getting so lucky getting Blastoise and Piplop up front every time. Uh, right. Um, great ball, see who we get. Big Charm, Water Energy, the Dene, because that is the only form of draw that we're going to get. Um, I can sacrifice Cynthia, I can get her back with Cynthia and Caitlyn. No, I'm okay. Definitely Rowlet and the Lonely Executor. And it's definitely gonna be Rillaboom. Yeah, there we go. Right, great ball. Snom, please. Or Dedene. That's fine. I don't want the other one. Right, and then Dede. Because I already have Dede. Uh, another Blasters Pip. Squirtle. Pokey Get. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna save that for next turn. Because then we get an extra draw out. It just just kind of helps. Um, let's see. Hopefully it's someone, hopefully it's something good. Maybe Cynthia. Cynthia would have been nice to have. I can accept Cynthia and Caitlyn. But it definitely is Rowlet and Alolan Executor. Wow, Lily. People are still using Lily. Ever since that new kind of rule came out, Lily's just been useless. Lily's been so useless. Um, there's Frostmoth. Right, yeah, get me something. Cynthia and Caitlyn, or actually Cynthia and Caitlyn, get ready for the next turn. Get ready for the next turn. Why didn't he? Do... Why didn't he get? Um. Okay, you know what? I'm not even gonna complain. I'm not gonna complain about it one bit. Cynthia, come back. Draw, draw, draw. Get okay, swell, and we're done. We are done. Well, Chaotic Swell's got Life Forest settled. That is a lot of shaman. I'm gonna have to really pack the damage on this. Blastoise would be very useful, actually. Another Bill's Analysis is a good potion. Oh, you're just gonna heal every little bit of damage that I've done. So let's see, that to be... So two, four, six, because it's 20 damage each. Two, four, six, so what will take, so, um, Levani takes off 40. Is that right? 40, that makes 100, and then Great Potion makes 150. Oh my gosh. So I can literally throw everything at you, and you would heal anyway. Oh my lord. Um, right, great Ball. Snom, please. Nope, still no Snom. I am sad. I is sad. We have no Snom. 
Um, actually, it's the end already. We have more than enough draw. Yeah, let's work it. Let's, let's, that'll work. I is sad that we have no snom. Um, I suppose. I mean, the only way that I can get a way that I can that I can somehow make this is literally if I don't know. This is so hard, dude. The only way that I can make it around him is if I hit the bubble launcher. Look at this. This is insane. I hate. Ah, oh, this is so insane. It's a good thing we got Kato Xwell down first, though, because then Life Forest would have killed us. Life Forest would have destroyed us. Right, we need to be quick. We need to try and be as quick as we can, which means we need Snom. I really need Snom. No, Misty and Lorelli. I can't. I can't waste it. I need to. Get, I need to get Misty and Lorelli out. Right, attach. I'm gonna say. I'm gonna keep blast. I'm gonna keep Squirtle on the bench because when Fro when Frostmoth comes out, we can we can do it. Right, it just heals all over again. It's a good thing for us. They haven't got energy. But I feel like that's not the point of their deck. I actually feel like their whole point of their deck is to is to run us down. <laughs> I actually feel like the whole point of their deck is to literally run us down. Because look how much look how much cards we've wasted. And we haven't even got a scratch on him. Right, two th well, he doesn't use great potion. We we've got him. We've got him in the knockout. Oh, okay. That's definitely two. Ugh. Right, okay. Um Oh boy. Right. Evolution incense, word turtle. I mean if anything, Blastoise can literally do the fattest amount of damage if we can get him. Right, missing the rally, such that for three cards, for the draw. Right, okay. We've got one in the discard. Um, I have a feeling you've got mixed herbs again, which basically made it useless, made it completely pointless. Um, attached to War Turtle because get we need to get ready. We need to get Blastoise ready, and we need to get him ready quick. Um, and I need that other KOX as well because Life Forest is coming, and that is going to be very very bad. If there's mixed herbs in there. We're very screwed. Yes, we did it. Yes. Okay. It was a stolen mechanic. Because if that was energy, we would have been very, very screwed. But anyways, announcement time. Woo, boy. Okay. So, last and Pip. Um, I like it. It's so much better than what it was before. I I love it. I've got literally nothing wrong with it. Um, the only addition was Frostmoth. It was sad that we didn't get to see Frostmoth like, come into play properly. Um... But I love it. I, I really, really like this deck. It's really, really cool. Um, Blastoise of Piplup does amazing. Um, we didn't even get to see Blastoise in action properly either. It was pretty much all Blastoise and Piplup, to be honest. Um, Misty and the Ready, I can't complain. Marnie helped us at that at one of the games. That was amazing. Big Charm as well helped us amazingly. It's amazing how much 30 damage goes a long way. Um, I've got nothing to say about it. Swift Raft, again... I'm so shocked that no one uses Swift Raft for water decks as much as they should. It came out in Dragon Majesty if you guys are interested in getting it. I would highly recommend getting Swift Raft if you're focusing on water decks because it is so useful. It's so useful and I don't understand why people aren't using it. It's so good. Um, but that's that's my opinion anyway. Um, I have I don't really know who to, who to take out, who to add in because it seems pretty, seems pretty open and shut. Um, Coach Trainer, that one copy can help out in a pinch. Um, again, Marnie helps out in a pinch. Cynthia's great. Um, Professor Arms Lecture's just there just to get Squirtle and Snom ready. Um, I've literally got nothing to complain about. Um, if you guys have any idea on what I should add in and what I should take away, please let me know. Um, if you guys have any idea on what deck I should try out in the future, again, let me know. I'll try my hardest to get it done. 
But as always, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, always click like and always click on the video. You guys are always welcome back, and I will see all of you in the next video. Right, guys, take care, and I will see you all later. Okay, bye.